Starting today, some Hawaii schools are offering the COVID vaccine for Keiki, 5 to 11 years old, on campus. Kaylee Hunt joins us live from Kalihi with all the details. Morning, Kaylee. Good morning. I have been out here all morning long talking about the vaccination clinic and with me for this live interview is Brooks Baird. Now he's with the Department of Health. Good morning and thank you for joining me and thank you for being out here. Delighted to be here, Kaylee. So we have some questions. I'm sure parents are at home thinking, all right, what is this vaccination entails? How close have you been working with the school districts in regards to rolling out some vaccinations? Department of Health has been working closely with the Department of Education for months now, not only uh, on the vaccination effort for kids 5 through 11, but throughout the pandemic to make sure that schools are a, a, as safe a possible environment as they can possibly be for students. So we're delighted uh, today that Kalihi Uk Elementary here in Kalihi Valley is the first school that is going to now be offering vaccines to kids 5 through 11. And in the coming weeks, we expect uh, upwards of 150 campuses statewide will be offering the Pfizer vaccine for kids in that age group 5 to 11. That's really exciting. Now, the CDC came out with this news of Pfizer being okay for kids 5 to 11, November 2nd. So what if we have parents sitting at home right now saying, well, I don't really want to wait around until my school holds a vaccination clinic. What would your advice be for them? Uh, my advice is that there are lots and lots of places where parents can take their youngsters to get them vaccinated. Uh, last week, hospitals and medical facilities began administering vaccines for kids. Uh, parents can also take their youngsters to community health centers to um, pharmacies, to um, pediatricians' offices. There are lots and lots of places around the state, including schools, where youngsters can get vaccinated. That's good to know, especially if for those parents who don't really want to wait around and maybe they want to do it on a Friday night or a Saturday night. Talk about the benefits of maybe waiting till the weekend. Well, if you wait till the weekend and you're worried that your youngster might uh, have some adverse effects and be kind of slow or sluggish or groggy the next day, sure, you can wait for a Friday afternoon or a Saturday, and then the youngster has all day Sunday uh, to, to, to recover in case there are um, any uh, of those minor side effects. Um, and, and you can go shopping for a vaccine location by going to hawaiicovid19.com, click on the vaccine button, and you'll see a map come up uh, where you can kind of look around in your neighborhood and see where you can get your youngster vaccinated. You can find out uh, the, the location, the phone number and address, and the clinic hours. Perfect, Brooks. Thank you so much for being here this morning and talking to us, giving us really good information about the vaccine clinic that's taking place today. Now, it starts at 8.30 a.m. I'm going to be out here all morning long giving you guys the latest. That's the latest for now. Reporting live in Honolulu, I'm Kaylee Hunt. Guys, back to you in studio.